30 seconds. Our activation stations are all done in the morning in conjunction with tape, treatment, and breakfast. It's designed to help prepare our athletes' body and make sure that they learn the importance of preparation at a high level. What I like to say is 10 minutes a day of taking care of your body will save you 10 days on the side with us. Everything we do in the activation is designed to prevent injuries and more of a prehab concept to ensure our players are healthy. Station one is centered around soft tissue. We use implements like PVC pipes, softballs, golf balls, and that's really designed to promote blood flow and release any of those trigger points that are in the body. This is where you get those oohs and ahs because the guys are sore and they found a knot inside their body. Station two is our mobility station. It's designed to stretch our tight muscles and restore that length tension relationship. Our guys are desk bound athletes and as they sit in meetings, they get tight inside certain areas. The hip flexors and the quads being one of them. So we'll put this band around the leg, we'll squeeze the glute and we'll let them stretch that quad and hip flexor out. Going back to that desk bound athlete, we'll make sure that we do hip extensions. Putting our feet on the cardboard gives us a little bit more proprioception, unbalanced. And then you do hip extensions focusing on squeezing the glutes. You can do different variations where you hold it at the top and bring your knee to your chest just to make sure that you're working on that bilateral or unilateral aspect of it. Then we'll do different things where we do a hold a push up position. Now this is helping us integrate our shoulder and our core at the same time. And then we're going to work on some running mechanic movement patterns where we extend the leg to get our glute to fire and then come up into a high knee march position to make sure our core is integrated with that movement. One thing that our student athlete is going to take away from here is it's not always about lifting heavy weights. Yes, head lifting heavy is important and there is definitely benefits to that, but there's the other side of the spectrum as well. You have to be flexible, you have to have functional movement and functional strength to be able to keep you healthy and move well. 